Hey, what's going on everyone? Spegmeister here, welcoming you to another episode in my Halo 3 ODST Legendary walkthrough. So last time I played, we went in as Mickey, gathered up a bunch of marines, and headed out to a rally point just outside the Oni building. In this episode, we're going to take a rather short stroll to seek out our fourth clue. Alright, so the beginning of this part actually picks up rather quickly. I'm not going to pull up the map until I clear out the enemies from this first dropship. So what you'll have to put up with are a couple of jackal snipers and a couple of jetpacking brutes. Now one of the snipers is going to make their way towards the center, I'm going to focus on him first. And then there's another one that is going to run parallel to the road ahead. This one too is also going to head towards the center. There we go. With both the snipers down, you shouldn't have too much of an issue taking on the jetpacking brutes from up here. As long as they're out in the open, you shouldn't have to go down to their level. There's the other one. Okay, so now that we have a little bit of breathing room, I'll pull up the map to show where we need to go. So this is going to be a rather short walk, as I mentioned in the intro. All we're going to do is Head down this way, head up these stairs, through this blast door, and we're going to enter the same area that we ended Kinsingo Boulevard, but instead we're going to head through another set of doors, and that's going to take us out to our next clue. Usually around this area, further ahead up by that blast door, or even further down the road that we came from in the previous Mombasa Street section, uh, you might have to put up with one or even two uh, random patrols. But as I see on the map, there is nothing that I have to really worry about, so I should be good. Uh, this red dot back here indicates some sleeping grunts. Since they're out of the way, I'm not going to bother fighting them. So if you have a random patrol up here, what you'll have are a couple of camo brutes along with a jackal sniper. Honestly, if that patrol was here, I'd probably take the long way around, just so that I don't have to fight them in close quarters. While I'm entering this area, I'm going to pull up the map again to see the layout. Uh, what I will pay attention to first and foremost is where the sniper is. He can be in one of two locations. He can be right above me as I enter, other times he might be directly across. In either case, I'm not going to make that sniper a priority. If he were over on the opposite side, what I would have to do is put this bridge between myself and him so I can take out the brute captain in the center. Reason why is because there's an engineer nearby. There's the captain. And if you do it right, Two shots, as long as the last one is a headshot, will kill him. Yeah. 
Uh, besides that, Captain, there are a couple more camo brutes that we'll have to put up with. Make them your next priority because they will try to rush you. Other than that, just clean up the remaining jackals that you can find, including that sniper. If that sniper is directly above you, you wouldn't have to worry about him until you cleared out everyone else. So I'll raise the map one more time. Now we're down to that sniper. So it looks like he's directly across from my position. I'm gonna try to lure him out with the carbine and then see if I can snipe him. There he is. Now unlike the other two Halo games where we've had these jackal snipers, you can actually take a hit from those guys as long as you're at full health. Now as we head down this corridor, there is going to be uh, a handful of grunts along with another brute captain. This time I'm not going to try to stealth these guys, I'm just going to try to kill the brute first and then engage the grunts like normal. Once you've cleared out that squad and head through this door, you'll find your next clue, and that'll take you into Oni Alpha site. Alright, and that is going to wrap up this section of the Mombasa Streets journey. I hope you guys found this guide to be useful in your way through the campaign. Uh, thank you all for tuning in on this episode. I am really thankful for the support that I've received so far. And I will catch you all in the next one. Take care, everyone.